all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 46 here on the frozen rock. And I have to apologize, obviously I missed last, getting a uh, episode up last Saturday. Uh, they've been doing some work around the place here, and uh, it was a bit noisy. They were putting in some new egress windows downstairs and stuff like that. So pretty much... Uh, uh, and that was all going along during last week anyway, so I just wasn't able to get a, a video done uh, with everything that was going on. So, today, we are going to get this finished down here. Uh, I've got the stairways coming down, i got the lighting coming down as you can see. I've done a little bit of work right down here, trying to give it kind of an industrial look where you're coming down, you've got these girders and stuff here. Uh, you've got an exit into uh, into the open part of the mine. So we're going to leave that like that. I've put some barbered plating. I'm going to leave them undone. Uh, so it kind of gives it that cage feeling. We've got uh, the tunnel all done and then what I want to get done down here is finish out the control room. Uh, put a few more things in here and get this finished up and get it painted. Uh, get this done out here. I don't know how much more I'll do out here, but I want to be able to erect some lighting. Uh, I may only bring this around alongside right out to about here maybe. And then, uh, again, get some lighting and stuff set up out here. Uh, maybe put uh, a slight wall, uh, something that looks like uh, it's kind of got beams in. Uh, I need to finish carrying that wall down in so it looks like it's anchored. And so, yeah, that's what I want to get done today. We'll have a door here and a door here. I was going to put a door down here, but I don't think so. I don't think there's uh, any good reason to put this. I've got the cage in here, and so I think that's what I want to get done today. Uh, and so once I uh, get a little farther along, I'll give you a progress report on what I've got done, and I'll uh, catch back up with you in a little bit. All right, well, I have uh, got quite a bit of scaffolding in. I, I don't have everything completed down here for because uh, I'm going to have to go get a bunch of parts. But I've kind of got the design out that I want. So you can see I've got railings that are long here so that you don't walk over here and fall off. Uh, I've got an access down in here, so if you have to do maintenance... Uh, you can uh, get down and in here and work on it. Uh, I've added lights on the sides right here. So that that adds, uh, so that as you're seeing that going down the tunnel, you'd be able to see where it's at in the tunnel. Now, I've got the stairs in here. I've added a light right here. That kind of lights up this area. It gives it a little more of a uh, feel for down in the uh, tunnel and down into the mine. More railings here. Let me turn the lights back on here. Uh, I've got a door in place. And I've got the, this all framed in. So I'll need to get this all built out. Uh, and then I need to add some lighting into this area here. And then uh, add some, uh, I don't know, uh, crates of some sort. Uh, maybe a panel or two. Uh, I might put a uh, LCD panel up here. Uh, so that it looks like it's uh, uh, got some operational stuff going on. So this part is just needing to be finished up here I got another door right here and this part is pretty much all done down through here so uh, I actually think I need to put a little more lighting 
down into here. Uh, I think another light right here will probably do. Uh, somewhere in here, and then that kind of light up this area. All the lighting is done here, so you can see to get your way up and out of the mine and down into the mine. So, that's where I'm at at this point. Uh, once, uh, once I get uh, more of that built out, uh, I'll catch up back up with you. I've got to go get uh, more parts and whatnot, so i got a bit of running around to do. Uh, so when I get that, uh, when I get the parts and get that built out, I'll catch back up with you. Alright, just to give you a little bit of an update on where I'm at, I'm getting close to having this done down here. At least for now. I don't think there's much more that I'll want to do. Uh, but as you can see, we're coming down into the, uh, mine. And I got this, uh, I got lighting right here. Matter of fact, yeah, my light's off. I'm going to, I still got to finish these. I got to get the materials for it. But I'm going to have like freight boxes here. Some, uh, another set right here. It doesn't impede you getting down in through here. Uh, put a desk. I don't have much places that I can fit stuff. Uh, I might have been able to put a desk right there, but it just didn't seem to look quite right. Uh, I'm going to have, uh, I don't know what I'm going to put on here, but I need to, to get some sort of text screen on here, and I'll add that. Uh, and same on this side, which will add a little bit. Uh, so all the lighting is in down here. I've got uh, another set of... Uh, freight boxes here and down here just to add some interest to it and then uh, the lighting so basically I just got to get these freight boxes done and I got a set of lockers here and get this desk done and then I think I'll have this about done I also added a light I don't know if you can see it it's right there these are uh, tinted glass so that's why it doesn't look like it is shining too much but we'll go out there and take a look at it uh, and then uh, yeah it's getting close oh, better turn my light on So I did add this light right here and I did get those pillars all the way down uh, so that that looks more supported instead of just kind of hanging out in the middle of nowhere. So yeah, and it looks like daylight's coming. So let me get those uh, last cargo boxes done and I will give you another update when we have this actually completed. Then we can kind of decide what's next. So I'll uh, catch back up with you in just a little bit. All right. Well, I think I am about done with this drilling platform and operation. Uh, we've already ran the drills. We've already filled up the storage containers I could run it again but we've got plenty of coal right now so I've got the rails all in got the safety features in so that you're not going to fall off the edge uh, you can get down below for maintenance uh, we've got uh, cargo boxes that can hold uh, spare parts and whatnot the lights are all in actually let me turn my light off and so we have uh, those lights, uh, a set of lockers, so if somebody's down here, they can store their stuff, their lunch and whatnot. I know this room looks a little bare, but uh, it's only one block high, and with the lights and the panels and whatnot, it pretty much takes up all the blocks uh, 
uh, spaces. Uh, I might have been able to put one, maybe something right there. I might come back and do that when I actually put something on the LCD panels. But this is pretty much done. Uh, oh, you know what? I've got to be in a habit of closing these doors. We've got the doors in. And let's close that. And this hallway is all done. The tunnel is done. Uh, we just, I showed you the lighting on uh, this side. And I did get some lighting in here. So there's enough lighting to see to get up the stairs. And yeah, I think uh, we're going to call this done. So now, with it being nighttime out here, uh, it's time to get back over to the other base. And I think what I'm going to do is actually haul these supplies that I have here back over there. Just so that uh, I can uh, get a better handle on what I have for parts. Uh, I think one of the things I do have to do is uh, look at my inventories on all of my uh, production machines over there. Because I think they're getting backed up with like silicon and nickel and stuff like that. And so I can move all of that stuff into that large cargo container. But once I get over there, I get this stuff hauled over there. And we can start laying out a plan on what's next here for this base. Uh, again, I think I mentioned ultimately what I want to do is be able to get to space. Once I get to space, then I think uh, we will call this season about good and really kind of plan and start on the next operation. So, all right, once I get uh, over there and kind of get settled in and get this stuff moved, I'll, I'll catch back up with you all. All right, I have gotten back over here to the base. I've done a lot of kind of maintenance stuff. I think the next thing, so I moved over the coal production under the completed column. So we've gotten all of that stuff done. Uh, this is what I still have on the list to do. So I think... Uh, Actually, that garage is pretty much done. Probably can move that over. Uh, I need to go to the control room that I want to build, which is underground. And that is going to be out over here. So let's get over and take a look at what I have over here. So we've got the garage and the whole purpose was to get our lone spawn point in protected making sure that nothing happened to it so it's down here in the garage I could probably do some doors and all of that and I might get to that at some point uh, but that's kinda low priority so really the next one or the next item is down here uh, in uh, I want to build a room off in this direction and this is where the control room is going to be so which means I'm gonna to have to do some tunneling let me double check something here I thought I had uh, all right, let me turn all of these on. These are kind of my waypoints that I use to build with. I don't think I have any others. All right, let's see. Okay, so that's the home base. That's where I have that. I have a marker here. That's Kingfish 3. I don't really need that anymore. So let's get rid of it. Uh, we can delete that. 
now let's see kingfish one that was this one right here we can get rid of that there we go clean up some of this stuff now Kingfish number two. Let's go find it. I might have had it. Okay. Did I have it for out here? Hmm. All right, let's go back down. So that's Kingfish four. I had right. Here. That must be down below. So let's go look at it. Okay, yeah, I think Kingfish 4 was right here. Uh, that's where I wanted to get to there. All right, so we can we can actually eliminate that one as well. Let's go ahead and delete that. Now, Kingfish 2. I guess I had to kind of mark it. I kind of know where that's at up there. And so we got the home base there. Uh, well, I think the next room we're going to want to kind of just build a little bit of a tunnel out through here and then uh, start uh, start building it out. Uh, I think <clears throat> once I once I kind of figure out where I'm going with this, I'll uh, catch back up with you all. I think it's I've got to go straight. I don't know if I've, I'm going to need to turn and kind of head this direction now. Uh, if I need to kind of go out and then cut to the right a little bit uh, and then up because I want to be able to link in to where the home base is and I want to be able to have an exit coming up through there so let me uh, go and see if I can figure out exactly where I want that to come up at and then I'll catch back up with you all all right well I think I'm going to start working on wrapping the video up today, but I want to show you what I've got or what I've done. So I've drilled this tunnel out straight out to here, and I've put a GPS marker here, and then I put a GPS marker right here, and then I put one up right here. Now the theory is I should be able to go up and line those up and know pretty much exactly where I'm at and on which direction that tunnel is coming out. Which I think I know which direction it was, uh, but this will just help confirm it. So if we go up and find our GPS markers, so there's five. So if we come over here, and I kind of get lined up. So there's, so we are somewhat lined up right here. So the tu that tunnel is running this way. 
and it's kind of heading out in this direction which is the way I thought it was running now I so if I go back over here and kind of try to get directly over number three which is about Zero, there we go. All right, which is about right here. Which I want to kind of head over in that direction. So I want to make my control room just about where I'm at. So what I am going to do is excavate that area out down there. Uh, and then uh, start heading in the direction of that marker over there once I get that built and then I'm going to have a stairway that will come down through there and so the interesting part will be can I merge those together what's going to happen and I may end up just having a stairway coming down into kind of a room from that direction and we're going to see if we can kind of merge these blocks together and then that will connect the garage and the control room and the farming room all together. So, yeah, I think uh, that's uh, what I'm going to be working on in the next uh, episode. Uh, and again, I want to build this somewhat out and then uh, drill down and make a connection up through here. And so it'll be coming up and out into the production facility. And I want to kind of extend this platform out a little bit more and then kind of work from over this direction. So, coal production is completed, finally. Uh, I added build a ship to go to space. That'll be down on there. Once I've kind of finished the control room, and the garage. There's not much left to do in the garage. Maybe put some doors and stuff like that in. I don't know if I'll get back up to fix the drills at the bauxite mine or not. And the one thing we haven't found is copper. We've kind of found all the other ores, uh, but I've been able to get enough copper out of the uh, gravel or the stone that I've been mining. So that's been, we've been able to kind of produce everything that we needed to produce. All right, well, I think we are gonna call the video good uh, right here. It is a nice, beautiful afternoon here on the rock. And yeah, I think it's a, we finally got something accomplished. All right, everyone, if you uh, enjoy the video, uh, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video a lot. And please subscribe, that really helps the channel out a lot. All right, space engineers, keep building a way out there and uh, come up with some uh, great creations. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.